Poison, like many other synthesizers, also has an effects chain that you can use. In Poison, you have two effects available, and these can be used to thicken up the sound. Firstly, you have a delay that can run in sync with your host's tempo and the chorus effect. I'm going to assume that most of you understand what a delay and chorus are. Both of these effects have wet controls. These effects are mixed with the original sound dependent on this setting here. Turning it all the way to the left will effectively turn the effect off, while turning it all the way to the right will give you a 50% wet and 50% dry signal. Both effects also have an on-off switch, allowing you to be able to quickly turn off the effect if you want to addition the dry sound. The next two controls of the delay allow you to control the delay in both the left and right channel of your sound independently. Once the sound is passed through these controls, I will replay the sound a second time. With the feedback control, turn completely left, then this is how it will stay. The feedback control is used to feed the delay sound back through the delay effect. The first echo will play the same, but the second echo will be a percentage of the volume and volume. When it is passed through again, the echo will be reduced again by the same amount. Eventually the effect will drift off to zero volume. The percentage of volume that decreases at each stage is determined by these controls. The sounds of the echoes can be further manipulated by using the low cut and high cut filters. The reason for this is that when you hear a real echo, the sound itself is reduced in volume in both the high and lower ends of the frequency spectrum. The amount of distance that the sound travels will increase this effect. The chorus effects works in a very similar way as the unison control that we looked at in an earlier chapter. However, instead of creating voices at set intervals, the pitch of the sound changes over time. The exact amount that this tuning varies is set by the depth control, and the rate control controls the speed at which this change of tuning is applied. These two effects can be put to good use in giving your sound a bit more body and a bit more ambience.